Hey guys, week six, Will and Max puppies. This has been such a fun, fun, big week for them. It's been, it's been awesome. You can see we've upgraded Diggs. They have a lot more space to run and play now, which they love. We've added this puppy slide for them. They took to that immediately. It has steps on one side. They try to play with this little ball hanging off the side and they climb the ladder. They also like to get underneath it, underneath a little slide and sleep. Hi Lucy, are you kidding me? So they love that toy. I've been hanging toys like this off of the side of the pen so they get to tug and play with them. They also continue to have loose toys in here. Um, so they spend a lot of time trying to get the balls out of this and we put them back in. It's a hide and seek toy that they like. And mommy keeps bringing tennis balls in the pen and taking them back out. She, Willow, is crazy for tennis balls, so she brings them in here all the time. But they're growing like weeds. They're all super healthy. They're all doing really, really good. We have a big week this week and that we get our first vet appointment on Thursday. They'll get their first baths on Wednesday. So looking forward to that. I know they'll do great. Um, also, starting this weekend, I start introducing them to car rides other than just the vet. So we drive them around in the neighborhood, in a crate for um, like start out with five minutes the first day. The second day we might do seven minutes. The third day we might do eight or ten minutes. Um, just to slowly build up all of their time and get, getting them used to the car. So it should be easy ride home for you. It shouldn't be anything scary. <laughs> what is it Lucy? Hey. But they're all playing great together. They do really, really well. Most of these guys are used in the litter box. I would say probably 80% of the time right now, maybe a little more. They're doing really good with it, so I'm super proud of that. They're picking up quicker than a bunch of my litters do. What? I think Lucy wanted a little extra loving. What is it? My kids are getting a lot more playtime with them um, as well now that they're getting older. It's always supervised, of course. They're getting to come play in my kitchen and run around the kitchen and the living room. It's all big open area. So they just run laps and go crazy. And they still are getting longer and longer play dates with Callie's puppies. Callie only has two and they're born only a day apart. So we do let them play and interact and spending more and more time together. And it's good for all of them to interact with the dogs that aren't their siblings and get used to that. So that's also going great. Callie and Willie are happy with it and all the puppies play. So that's awesome. Hi Garish. But I'll wait. the other two I think are tired from their puppies. So here's Dobie running around playing like crazy. She kind of bug. Marcel is sleeping. Hey, baby girl. Hi, Marcel. She's just snoozing. <laughs> they're so funny. It's just a little safe haven, so they really like it. It's kind of like a cave or a den. Um, you guys can see here in the back, I've added a crate. They do go play in that and are used to that. It's the same crate that I'll take them to the bed in and ride them around in the car in. So they have that introduction. They're used to that. We continue to play sound desensitization music for them three times a day. They still go to sleep at night listening to music. We kind of right now they're listening to just normal pop radio, top 40 kind of stuff. Every night as they go to sleep. What you doing, Phil? You guys see Marcella. She went straight back to her bed. She's ready for a nap. She's normally very, very energetic. Like I said, they just been playing a lot this morning, running around playing a lot, and then we did puppy pictures. So she's just a little tired and ready for her afternoon nap. But they're all just doing great, guys. I couldn't be more pleased. 
I continue to do things. Everything I do with them, every toy that's in here is for a reason and for a purpose to help them grow to become strong, confident puppies and to be great family members for you guys. We will start treat training with them this week to help them start learning all how to sit and be uh, learn all their little puppy tricks. But that typically starts this week as well. I did change their puppy food, which I think Austin Doodle has let you guys know. They just were not, they didn't really like the other kind. I've used it for years and years. All my dogs love it, mom dogs eat it. Um, but these puppies just were not eating very much and they were still trying to feed off mom a whole lot. So I wanted to help that along. I changed their food. They love the new food. They're eating it really, really, really well. So I think it might just be a better fit for them. So now they're feeding Neutro Puppy Naturals Chicken. So, um, but it just seems to be working well for them. And you know, we always just have to make adjustments on whatever's best for that particular puppy and that particular litter. Everything doesn't always go just with, well, here's what I feed every single time. Which you have to make adjustments that work best for the puppies. Because their health is what's most important. <laughs> they continue just to be sweet love bugs there. But we're having a great week. Next week is going to be even lots more excitement for these guys. Lots more fun things going on. And um, so we'll talk to you guys next week. Have a good one.